The Clinical and Translational Science Collaborative in Cleveland is leading the way in bringing research from lab to life, with a specific goal of bringing researchers from the many institutions in Cleveland's world-renowned healthcare industry together with the community. The CTSC is realizing results. One example is a collaborative study funded by the NIH called IMPACT, Ideas Moving Parents and Adolescents to Change Together. This study seeks to reverse the trends in childhood obesity by looking at the problem from various angles, with an end goal of making an immediate impact on Cleveland's rising childhood obesity rate. Obesity is a very complex thing to tackle, and I'm convinced that no one discipline alone is going to do that today. We bring together expertise in biology, medicine, pediatrics, behavior and behavior change. So this is truly a multidisciplinary approach. This isn't just a multidisciplinary scientific team. It's a multi-institutional team. Without our community partners, such as the YMCA of Greater Cleveland, the Cleveland Metropolitan School District, and even the Rite Aid Marathon program, this study could not happen. Leona Cutler, one of three principal investigators of the IMPACT study, is a pediatric endocrinologist and researcher who works with the team to bring clinical experience in childhood obesity and expertise in research. The Center for Child Health and Policy works with, on the IMPACT study by providing expertise in, in many areas, including the background on childhood obesity, its impact, how to deal with it clinically, the biological basis of it, the analysis of outcomes, and the dealing with families. It was very far-sighted of the NIH to develop a request for applications on childhood obesity that deliberately asked for a multi-level approach. Another facet of this unique research approach is to focus on family-based intervention, to implement new behavioral approaches. Principal investigator Shirley Moore spearheads this effort. In the IMPACT project, the nursing students at Case Western Reserve University have service learning. They do actually the blood pressures, the heights and weights of all the children in the Cleveland uh, School District. Those actually became our screening mechanisms. It's more than just thinking that people are going to change because they're supposed to. So we've learned that it's very interdependent on the people you live with, the things around you, your environment. And in the IMPACT project, we're going for changing families' patterns. I'm Latonna and I'm 13 and I'm trying to lose weight. Well, it's very important to me because I want my daughter to be healthy. My goal is to lose weight and be healthier and stronger. And I'm on my way. We're participating in this program as a family, learning how to be healthier together. The researchers know what we're going through, so they're kind of there for us. Being that it's all of us, we're all avoiding like the soda and the chips. It makes it easier and together we're going to succeed at getting healthy. The third component of the IMPACT study is a school community intervention and neighborhood influence. Elaine Borowski, Principal Investigator and Director of the Prevention Research Center for Healthy Neighborhoods, serves as the linkage between the academic team and the community partners. It's all about working with our community partners. If we engulf children in both a family, a school, and a neighborhood environment-focused intervention, then we may be able to reverse the trend. And so part of that is the children will be in a study-enriched school that has the program called We Run the City Youth Marathon Program. In addition, we're going to be collecting data both at the child's home, their school, and their neighborhood level. And so once we can identify, for example, if there's a corner store between school and the home, this will help our navigators to guide the family to obtaining a healthy lifestyle. So you begin to see that the child ha feels supported at all levels um, of their lives. At the heart of the IMPACT study is the involvement of both the Greater Cleveland YMCA and the Cleveland Metropolitan School District. The IMPACT study assists our Youth Marathon Program coaches by setting up different trainings for them so that they can help IMPACT students in the We Run the City Youth Marathon Program. Being tied with CASE and CTSC, they do our pre and post evaluation. It gives the kids an idea of what they're doing. You know, I started out with a BMI of a 25 and now I'm a 24. Data is everything in this society today, particularly in schools. And in physical education and activity, we're limited as how much data we can 
possibly get our hands on. So this is going to be a very big tool in order for us to show that the impact that they have in activity plays a part in the classroom for academics as well. We're all in this together in Cleveland as we look to revitalize our region. It is critical that all of the entities, all of the partners, work together to uh, help our students and help our families be more viable. The impact study is another way researchers in Cleveland and the CTSC are changing lives and improving the health of the Cleveland community. The things that, that are, we are gaining through this team science approach, we come from very different orientations and different perspectives, but we hammer out those differences and I think in the end this will be a very powerful study because of that. We're working with inner city families and I think one of the things that they've taught me most is that they really care about health and they want to make change. Through team science, we can make a big difference in the lives of children and families.